You can't exactly blame Joe Biden for this whole thing. That's an ADT. Like, that's just a poor excuse for the reason. Joe Biden just showed up at the doorstep when it took place. But as a consequence of being an insider for as long as Mr. Biden has, he knows the whole story. But there's nothing that he can do about it now. There's nothing he can do about it. He's got to serve the black community as he promised. The guy in voted, and that's it. And, you know, there's a reason for that. that that's the moral choice that anyone would have to make at that level, at that position. But you see how controversial it is? You see how it bankrupts nations? You see how the consequence of the business of the spoils of globalism, which has produced vast wealth, the ability to float vast amounts of currency, but at the same time, people are not exactly starving, but they're desperate. The food issues, Thomas would have been solved, but the consequences of an advanced civilization, the advanced society, blah, 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 guy goes on, blah, 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 but you can't just lay it at Joe Biden's feet. You just can't hang your globalism and the sociological wreckage around Joe Biden's throat. That's this is not right. But this is what he's not to do. Put a sign on his back, tape it without knowing, say, kick me on Joe Biden. You see, this is not, there's no traction there, there's no productivity, but that's exactly what's going to happen. Because this is what got them elected, this is what got them the hysterical vote, got them the entire the House, the Senate, and it's not exactly uh, a crash, but it threatens to become one. It threatens to become one in a big, very, very, very big way. Uh, uh,